In this video, we're going to take a look at how you can watch videos that your instructor has posted to your WAMAP course. And those might show up in a couple different ways. So I have two different examples here. If your instructor has just posted a link to the video, it will show up like this graphing a line thing that I have here. You can click on this kind of box with an arrow coming out of it. And that will open the link up in a completely different page. But you also have the option, most likely, to watch the video without leaving the WAMAP page itself in this little plus in brackets. If you click on that, it should open up, if that's an option, should open up the video right within the WAMAP page so you don't have to leave it. You can click on the video, play it right from in there. You still have the option, depending on what site it's coming from, to go to the actual site and full screen it if that's an option. All right, and then if you didn't want that to clutter, you can actually press the minus in the brackets and shrink that back down out of view. The other option that your instructor might use to post videos, if they want to post a whole bunch of them in sort of an inline text item in WAMAP, it might show up like this. So you could have it as an individual playlist. That's an option if your instructor chose to use that. Or you might have a list of videos, each with their own plus next to it. Just click on the plus next to the one you want to watch, and it'll expand that one out. But if it is as a playlist, you can click on the link of any of these, and it will just sort of autoplay from that point. I got to rescroll down to it, but it'll autoplay from that point in the playlist, and you can press forward and back to get to different videos within that playlist. So that's how you can view videos that your instructor has posted in your WAMAP course.